name is Bob Fall. I'm a research engineer here at the Forest Products Laboratory. I do research and testing of uh, wood building products. Well, the test that we're doing today is part of a research program to develop a wood-based tornado safe room, a safe haven that you can go to during a tornado that is built completely out of uh, commodity wood products such as lumber, plywood, oriented strand board that you can buy at Home Depot. Okay? The standard tests for testing safe rooms is shooting a 2x4 that weighs 15 pounds and 12 feet long at 100 miles an hour. That simulates a 2x4 flying at 250 miles an hour uh, in a 250 mile an hour wind or an EF5 tornado, the most severe uh, tornado category. We shoot that at the wall and the criteria is that if that 2x4 pierces the wall, it's a failure, or if it creates too much debris that would blow inside the safe room, then that's also a failure. We're trying to make this safe room uh, easy for anybody to build. For a do-it-yourselfer, that if you can use a nail gun and normal handyman tools, you could build this safe room to go in your house. And that's an important aspect. Most state, uh, safe rooms you can only put into new construction. And so to make existing homes safer, we wanted something that you could carry the materials down in your basement, for example, uh, and build it. So with this design, if you can carry a sheet of plywood or an eight foot two by eight down in your basement, you can build a safe room and be a lot better off if a tornado comes. Also, uh, safe rooms are quite expensive, from six to $15,000. We believe we can build these, this safe room for about three to four thousand dollars. So that's another incentive for people to put one in their home. About the cost of a hot tub.